Hi, Yarnabees. It's Sandy. How are you today? You can't see me, can you? <laughs> you gotta love it when you come home and you find two Premier Yarns boxes sitting at your door. Yeah. Loving, loving, loving it. Hi! <laughs> oh, let me put these down. <laughs> Okay, oh, and there goes my water. Okay, I think we're gonna... <laughs> I'm dropping water. I'm like, oh yeah, it's a mess. Anyway, let me bring you in just a little bit. Okay, how's that? Not quite, there we go. Hi! <laughs> How you doing? Today is Tuesday. It's after the long weekend. Whew. What a weekend. Totally missed shout out Sunday. Uh, yeah, I'm trying to get this tutorial done for the cardigan and totally didn't think about anything else. <laughs> Still not done yet, but it will be done in the next couple of days. <laughs> so Okay, let's get on to the yarn. Not only did I get two boxes of Premier Yarns, I also got a bag uh, from, is it Hirschner's? Hirschner's. And I got that bag a couple days ago. See in this? See this? See this? Yeah. This is the Bag o Day Sun Hat Gone Wrong. <laughs> I don't know what it is, but I can't for the life of me do a brim on any hat. I am struggling badly. Her brim is nice and flat. My brim is not. It's, yeah. And I got a wire in here and everything, but that's okay because I've seen lots of sun hats that have the brim up like that. And it's, it doesn't look too bad. Does it? Does it? It, it it's kind of cute, right? Maybe. <laughs> so what I used was, and I'm so, oh, you know what? It's dark in here. I haven't got the light on. There we go. I'm just a hot mess today the heck ah uh, okay so i used the lion brand rewind tape yarn yes i did uh the cut co this color oh let me tell you some of the specs wow this um this is like really small writing Okay, there's 242 yards, 221 meters in a skein. It's a five weight. And this is called current situation. <laughs> That's hilarious. Okay, so if you've never seen tape yarn before, it's flat. Okay, it's a flat yarn. But when you work with it, it kind of twists and everything, and it works out just like regular yarn. This stuff is soft, guys. Like, it's really, you would think that it would be kind of twiny. It's not. It's really soft. And I was quite um, excited to work with it. You can, you can make garments with this. That's how soft it is. And I just might do something like that. <laughs> We'll have to see. So anyways, this is the garnet situation. Okay. Voila. This ad's not quite finished. I have something coming from eBay. You know how um, Crystal put a wedding belt around her hat? Well, I'm getting um, their rhinestone headbands with the ribbon on them. I'm going to be putting that around this one. And then when I make the other ones, I'll be putting that on there as well. I've got a couple of them coming, which should be here in a couple days. This one 
is called Trade Winds. Isn't that nice? It's kind of, it's like jean. Like this would go really good. This kind of, this hat will go really good with a pair of jeans. Yeah. Okay, so there's that one. And then this one, oh, I'm working on a hat with this right now. And this color is called Willow. Okay. Uh, so yeah, I'm currently working on another hat. So yeah, guys, there's other colors too, but I just got these three because I didn't want to go overboard until I worked with the yarn to see how it works up. I love it. Love it. Okay. <sighs> okay. <laughs> I'm not used to seeing myself in a sun hat, but whatever. <laughs> Alrighty, now I can't for the life of me figure, I don't know why I got these, these yarns, but I did. Um, cause this is like a really, really fine yarn. Um, this is cotton batik. And hang on, let me get it out of one of these bags here. And it's, um, oh, wow, that's soft. Uh, there's 180 yards, 165 meters. It's 100% cotton. I usually hate 100% cotton, but this is really soft. This is called Coral Crush. Oh, I guess I should show you the... Okay, isn't that pretty? Wow, that is really soft. Hmm, interesting. I got six of these. I'm really shocked because usually, um, I the cottons that I know of, they stick when you're working with them, and they just don't. I I just don't like them. But this is really soft. Huh. Interesting. Where is it made? Uh, Turkey. That's why. That's why they're caught in all of their stuff in Turkey. It's really nice. Hang on. I need a drink. Oh, excuse me. <laughs> Tell you, ever since I got that, uh, that fizzy machine thing, whatever the heck it's called, <laughs> for George for Christmas, I've been using it. I'm drinking a lot more water. It's awesome. <gasps> oh. oh, I have been looking at this yarn for a while, and it's been one of those yarns that's been in my cart, out of my cart, in my cart, out of my cart. And I decided to, um, to go for it because I think it was on sale and um, oh my god it's gorgeous uh, yeah whoops <laughs> okay well I just pulled this right out of the yeah okay okay here it is color fusion chunky Look at those colors. Look, Laura. <laughs> oh, those are so pretty. Oh, wow. And it's soft. It's like, yeah, it's really nice. Um, there's 109 yards, 100 meters. It's 100% acrylic. And this is called Neapolitan. Let's see, it's got the brown in there. I know I'm violating my skein, but <laughs> isn't it pretty? Oh, I got six of these. So, hmm, I'm thinking, what am I going to make? 
have to think about that. And then I got another color of the color fusion. And this is really pretty too. I'm so glad I, I jumped and decided to buy it because, uh, <clears throat> oops, this is, oh, wow. This color is woodland. Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh, and I got six of those. Wow, that is really nice. Hmm. Okay. Next box. Okay, this box is um, just basically stocking up on my premier yarns. Oh, this is nice. Um, for those of you that have been with me for a while, you know that Premier Basics is my go-to yarn. I love this yarn. Uh, it's just, it's never failed me. This color, okay, if you don't know Premier Basics, it's a medium four. It's 359 yards, 328 meters. It's 100% acrylic. This is teal, of course. It's actually darker than this. It's, oh, but it's so pretty. It's, it's a few shades darker than this. No, it's even darker than that. Yeah, it's close, but it's, yeah. Oh, it's so nice. It's so nice. Because, see, I have some, oh. You can't see, but this shelf down here is a little empty and, you know, <laughs> it's an excuse, right? Um, then I got, okay, that's bizarre. <laughs> These are all the three colors that I got, but they're all in separate things. And then they've got the one bag that has all three in it. So why I could have just taken out this one and not opened this bag. Darn it. <laughs> okay. How about I open this bag? Okay. Ooh, this is a nice color too. I got this color because of my mom. My mom loved Dusty Rose. And this is called Rose. It's actually, it's darker than this. Yeah, but it's a dusty rose and it's deeper, like quite a bit deeper than that. Oh, but it's so pretty. I was thinking about making a cardigan, you know, in, you know, um, in memory of my mom. And this one, um, this one's salmon. Again, it's darker than what it's showing. But it's really pretty. Hmm. Yeah. So I got uh, three, four. I got four each of each color. So that should be enough to make something fairly good. Um, I also got... A birthday card in the mail. Hang on, let me get it. Okay, so here it is. It's got some little things on here. And a... <laughs> okay. Now this is from a subscriber that's been with me for quite a while. Oh, come on, out. Come out, come out. Don't fight me. There we go. It says, hooray. Aww. Dear Sandy, sending you the most heartfelt happy birthday. Hope you had ha have had 
a great day uh, of celebration on your special day. Love from your yarny sister, Cindy Crochet A. Oh, Cindy, thank you. And look, she made me a heart. Oops. Isn't that pretty? Oh, thank you, sweetheart. Oh, I had such an awesome birthday. I really did. Um, like I said before, I don't usually celebrate my birthday, but this one was definitely memorable. And uh, I'm glad that I videotaped it because now I can look back on it and remember uh, what happened because it was quite comical. If you don't know what I'm talking about, I'm going to leave this link, uh, the video woohoo thingy here. And then you can go and watch that video because it was, it was quite comical, quite comical. I'm going to put that right here, right there. Oop. Shiny. Oh, there we go. There you go. Whoop, come on. I got to get my nails done because they're getting too long. There. There we go. <laughs> Thank you, Cindy. Oh, that was so sweet of you. Ah, okay, guys. I think that's everything. Probably not. But, uh, yeah. I think that's that's pretty much everything for the moment. So thanks for joining me. Um, like I said, I'll get that, that um, cardigan video out soon. Very soon. Hopefully before the weekend. Uh, although for the next three days, I think I'm, I have to go an hour away from home to go DoorDash because there's no scheduling in Nanaimo for me. So that sucks. And it's only for like an hour and a half to two hours. So, but that's okay. We're still happy. <laughs> okay, guys. I love you. I will talk to you later. I hope you're having a great day. Okay, bye. Hi, everybody. I'm back. <laughs> of course, now that I've taken off my makeup and, you know, all that kind of stuff, uh, I'm, I'm back. <laughs> I got another box. <laughs> yes, I did. Uh, this is from Yarn Canada. I haven't, believe it or not, I have never ordered from Yarn Canada. I'm in Canada. Why wouldn't I try to order from Yarn Canada? I think it's because I always thought Yarn Canada was pricey. But when you think about it, I order out of Canada all the time. So when you convert it and you put the um, duties on it and all that, I'm probably paying way more. Eh. That's a depressing thought now that I'm thinking about it. <laughs> so anyway, um, so when I look at a ball of yarn in Canada and go $12, I'm not paying $12 for a, a skein of yarn. I'm probably paying more than that in reality when I'm ordering from out of Canada so Ugh. anyway I am excited about this and you guys are gonna laugh at me because you guys know I don't like thin yarn but now that I'm getting on this kick of oh sorry my hair is I washed my hair and I let it dry funny I had a nap and it's drying funny god my gray's coming back oh yeah anyway <clears throat> you're not here for that <laughs> um now that I'm getting on this kick of putting two strands together, I'm brightening my horizons. <laughs> so guess what I got? I got sheep cheese. Ah! I got stonewash sheep cheese. Ah! I'm so excited. <laughs> okay, so um, it is, let's see if I can, holy cow this color is boulder opal it's 78 percent cotton 22 percent acrylic and it's a sport weight oh every nerve in my body is screaming at me right now but you know what you can't deny how gorgeous this is 
like seriously. <laughs> uh, so I am going to put this with um, another yarn and see what comes out. Yay! I got one, two, three, four of these. Maybe a sun hat. Because oh, the colors that you the colors that are coming up right now. Oh, yes. Uh, you're gonna go, hmm, sun hat, definitely. Okay, this color is put your glasses back on, Sandy. Is barrel. Burl, burl. Wow. Look at that. Holy crow, crow, crow yeah, that. <laughs> Holy, I tried to say crap and crap, cow all together. And crow. Yeah, anyway. <laughs> Look at that. Does that not scream, sun hat? Holy. So I got four of those. Like, ah. Oh. Like, I am totally going outside my color palette, you guys. And I'm loving every minute. Okay. This color is yellow jasper. You can see the difference between the two. Isn't that neat? Okay, I got four of those. All right. And then I got... <laughs> Canada Jade. You know I had to do that, right? <laughs> Look at that. And can I just say, Canada Jade is not this color, but it's pretty. Isn't that pretty? Oh. Isn't it nice? Love it. BC Jade is actually really dark green. So, yeah. But that's okay, because this is really pretty. So I got four of those. So I got, oops, all of those colors. Aren't they nice? Outside my color palette. But look at my color palette now, you guys. It's turning, it's going from this to this. It's crazy. It's it's really crazy, but you know what? I'm going to just ride that wave. Yes, I am. And I love the fact that they have a center pull. Look at that. Very cool. Um, does it say how much I paid on here? No, it doesn't. I can't remember. But I'll put the link to Yarn Canada down below. I mean, most Canadians already know about Yarn Canada. Um, and I don't think anybody from the U.S. would ever order from Canada because prices are too high for them, I guess. But for us fellow Canadians, uh, yeah. So, okay, now I'm done. I hope, I think. <laughs> I got a lot of yarn today, so I'm really happy. <laughs> uh, so I'm going to go and finish my sun hat. And I will talk to you guys later. Okay. Bye.